In this presentation, I'd like to give you an overview of modular certification and what it means to you as a developer. Zero-G modules are built by leading manufacturers and all components of the module have been tuned by RF designers for best performance. Designing from a certified module from Zero-G will give you the ability to choose from multiple pre-tested configurations and cost options so that you can save money and have a faster time to market. Zero-G provides a broad set of specifications which satisfy standards defined by the industry and governmental bodies worldwide. This generally involves radio emissions, safety, and compatibility across wireless devices. Here is a picture of our certified module. Being certified means that the module complies to a set of required governmental directives and industry standards, that it does not cause radio interference to other products, that it remain compatible with existing wireless products and services, and that it also meets safety standards for the environment and consumer health. Overall, designing a product from a certified module will ensure that your RF design specs will comply with existing regulations and it will help facilitate your certification process. Zero-G makes it easy for you to build a Wi-Fi application. We offer 14 different antenna configurations, which include an onboard PCB antenna and 13 external antennas, covering various antenna games, radiation patterns, and range. Having such a wide set of certification reduces uncertainty and delay in the certification process because most systems generally need several attempts to pass. We also have test reports containing data that characterize our Wi-Fi modules and you can use these test reports in areas where you need additional certification. The cost savings that you get from designing with certified modules is substantial and it can save you anywhere from $40,000 to $100,000. There are four main categories when it comes to certification. The first one is intentional radiation. Intentional radiation, by definition, is the actual radio signal that is being generated and transmitted by the Wi-Fi module itself. Intentional radiation is anything that is broadcasting waves. On the other hand, unintentional radiation is the emission caused by the addition of different harmonics, oscillators, clocks, or transients that are present on the board. Think of unintentional radiation as the radiation produced by other parts of your system apart from the Wi-Fi module. The third certification is safety, and a certification in safety ensures that your product has met health, safety, and environmental requirements for the consumer. Finally, device interoperability. This certification exists to ensure that your device performs well when it's present in the same network as other wireless products and services. Zero-G certifies our Wi-Fi module for intentional radiation, safety, and device interoperability. However, we do not perform tests in unintentional radiation because this type of radiation is not generated from the Wi-Fi module and it will be up to you to obtain certification on unintentional radiation when you design your final product. The good news is that obtaining approval for unintentional radiation is typically much less costly and takes less time than intentional radiation, so most of the complex work in certification has already been performed by ZRG. Here is a chart of different areas of certification by agency. The first group is composed of several government agencies. These include the FCC, IC, Etsy, and Japan. And they define standards in intentional radiation, unintentional radiation, and safety. These are government agencies that regulate the communications industry by establishing regulations for RF devices to minimize potential interference to radio services. Zero-G modules are certified for intentional radiation and safety for the FCC in the United States and IC in Canada. If your product uses Zero-G certified Wi-Fi modules and then one of our certified antennas, the end product 
will not have to go through this set of approval. Zero G modules are also compliant with Etsy in Japan. Etsy in Japan offer modular compliance, and it does not offer modular certification in the same way that the FCC and IC do. However, the testing that we do for Etsy in Japan can be used when you apply for certification. The zero-g certification data can be included in your test plan and can significantly lower your certification burden. It will also provide you with certainty that your final product will pass. The second group of regulatory body includes CE and ROHAS, and they define safety standards in the European Economic Area and the European Union. CE and ROHAS are industry alliances that regulate the thermal and material safety, and the placement of their markings on an electronic device indicates that the device has met requirements for consumer safety, health, and the environment. Zero-G modules carry these C and ROHAS markings and comply with safety standards in this group. When zero-G modules are integrated with other devices that carry these markings, the end product does not have to go through the same certification process. However, if you're integrating the zero-G Wi-Fi module with non-CE or non-ROHAS devices, the end product must be recertified. The third group is the Wi-Fi Alliance, and they define standards on interoperability for devices based on IEEE 80211 specifications. Zero-G modules are Wi-Fi certified for 80211B. This certification is non-transferable on end products, but test reports for this certification can be used when applying for Wi-Fi. Here is an example of the cost breakdown in the certification process. Certification can be expensive and it can involve months of engineering work. Because there are so many different areas, the cost can amount up to $133,000 combined. This is why ZeroG has provided you with modularly certified solutions so that you can use to easily design with Wi-Fi. If you need more information about ZeroG, please visit our website or technical support site and check out some of the documentation available. Some of these include a set of frequently asked questions on our main website under technology FAQs and from the ZeroG Technical Support Center uh, you will find application notes in optimizing the network throughput and basic antenna guidelines. You'll also find technical briefs in regulatory and Wi-Fi certification as well as a list of certified antennas.